Hello everybody and welcome back to another Fishing North Atlantic. Now we did something insanely ridiculously stupid, but it's okay because that's what we are here to do. Now, we fast traveled to April 22nd, now it's April 23rd, and uh, we bought the coaster. Um, so we have eight million dollars uh, to pay back, basically. I mean, uh, roughly oh, 7.3 million. Uh, but I figured, you know what, we might as well just do it right quick, get the boat, because it's something new, and, uh, and I wanted to do it, so therefore, we did it. Now, I got kind of, not necessarily bored, but I got, uh, kind of wore out on the fish, uh, like, all the, on small fish and stuff like that, and I was like, you know what, let's, let's try something else. So we got this coaster in here, and of course, as soon as you see this video, which will be up, uh, I believe Wednesday of next week, um, well, Wednesday, uh, the day before Thanksgiving, basically. Uh, so as soon as we, you see it, of course, you can th throw a name down in the comment section below and, uh, tell me what you would want to name this bad mamma jamma. No, I mean, it's the coaster. Now, basically, this is the Northwestern, uh, from the Deadliest Catch series. Um, but, you know, I didn't want to copy that because it's already used and it's an actual boat and so, so on and so forth. And, uh, you know... And want to make it more personalized with us. Uh, so yeah, so if you have any ideas on what to uh, to name it and whatnot, let me know in the comments below, and then we will definitely go do it. Now, I don't know how fast this boat can actually go. I did upgrade absolutely everything we can. We got the storage doubled or maxed and so on and so forth. Now, I also don't know where any of the crab are, so I did get a little bit of a, uh, a tip uh, it was free, but it was from eight days ago. Now, of course, we can use that with a grain of salt. Now, we we might actually go back down here. I mean, it was four months ago, but there was a ton of crab down there. But let's go out here right quick just to see if there's any crab over here. And then if not, we'll go out to the deep end and see if there's any crab out there. Uh, I don't know how much the crab are actually worth at the moment. So let's actually take a gander here. Seven dollars a pound, and you know they they can weigh up to quite a bit. So holy mackerel, we we pretty much found the crab <laughs> already. Uh, so what we're going to be doing here is we're just gonna might as well just set the line. Now I don't want them too terribly far apart because I don't really know how long it takes. Well, we'll do that for now. Uh, there is one crab on there. Now of course we can also use the other boat to uh, do some lobster fishing. Uh, what is Graham good out here? Let's just kill the boat right quick. Graham, are you good at crane operating? Um, six. Uh, okay, so you're going to be my my pot setter, which is fine. Uh, let's see. Okay, bait and set pot. Who's good at crane operating? Six. 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 <laughs> okay, looks like anybody. Uh, hey, Mike, let, let's let's you do that there, okay? Oh, too far, too far. Now, hopefully, uh, we can get all that figured out. We're only going, you know, five miles an hour. We may have to speed that up just a touch more. But let's actually see this bad memo jam in action. Hopefully, it actually works. Go. Okay, do you have... Oh, hello. Huh. Let's actually speed this up to 7 just because it feels like we're going a little slow. Do I have to get your first pot ready? Whoa, hello. Vroom, vroom. Okay, what about over here? Oh, hello. Hello. Ooh, major lag spike. Okay, do I have to uh, tell him to go to bed first? I didn't do the tutorial again because, you know, what, what's the fun in that? So I didn't do the... Oh, hello. Why won't you do it? So weird. Oh, well, how 
corpse if you fucking move the dude, you fuck. Okay, so, <laughs> after that little bit of a doohickey, uh, we took a little bit of time to figure out what the hell we were doing, but now that we know what we're doing, we got her made in the shade. Now, hopefully, oh, if I drop, so then I can get out, because I gotta go down to the work deck. Where's the freezer? The freezer's over here. The freezer, come on, I don't got all day. We're over the crab now, not later. We're we're on them now. Uh, and there's no noise. Okay, so that's interesting. Run, run, run. Oh, okay. So he's already gonna do it. No big deal. Whatever. Okay. Now, maybe because he's there, can I actually have you on the crane operation now? Because it's already set up, so I should be able to just to set it and go, I think. R. Okay, so we got one pot over. Hopefully, though, we'll do actually some good here. Now, hopefully, these people actually do their job. I mean, if not, we'll have to do it. I mean, no big deal. No big deal. Okay, fine. I'll do it because I don't want you to work too hard. Oh, too far. I'm faster anyway at it. Uh, let's see here. W, A, and S is the thing. Do I have to stop driving to set it, I wonder? Okay, so there's going to be a lot of uh, back and forth here. I wonder, honestly, if I can set this guy here, get this all set up and ready to go. Kind of like like a, the fishing line, you know? You have to set it up for them because they're morons. You know, if you want it done right, you got to do it yourself, right? So here, I'm just going to bait the pot. I love how the door is just, you know, open and whatnot. That's fine. Okay, now Graham, go to the crane, and you go here. Let's try it. I don't know what I'm doing, so we'll, we'll definitely try it. There is crab underneath the boat, so that's good as well. I mean, there's a ton of fish here, too, so. Like a lot of fish. Set large pot. Okay. Will you actually do something this time? Nothing's happening. Okay. So I'll just run the stupid thing. No big deal. No big deal. I kind of wish I was, you know, fishing with uh, my nets and stuff because uh, there's a ton of fish underneath the boat. Now, I don't really know how much crab can be in the anything so I, I it's uh it's a learning experience for all of us let me tell you and i gotta go here and then as soon as it's done oh well i'm almost <laughs> almost got all the stuff already so it's ready to go, go here, operate you know on fishing barrett sea i uh we actually had to walk back and forth i left the freezer open uh, but we had to walk back and forth, and it was absolutely ridiculous, because it was all the way at the back, and it was just a pain. So, let's see. They're going to set another one. Now, I'm probably going to have to... Oh, there's a lot of crab right here. Oh, where's the mouse? Right here. Ooh, not ready yet. Not ready yet. Okay, okay. So, we're doing a little bit faster than normal. I like how the the buoy is just over the over the side. No big deal. No, we're we're figuring it out, you know. So we don't we don't need nobody else. We don't need Graham to help us out. 
I mean, it doesn't take too terribly long either to, to get all this stuff situated, so we'll just have to see how lucrative this is and uh, go from there, honestly. Oh. Oh. Okay. There we go. That was weird. So I think what I'll do is I'll set ten of them, and then as soon as I send ten of them, we will, uh, you know, get back here and uh, see what we can do. So I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, everybody. So we are back, and uh, we actually had the one second. Actually, I want the best ones. Let's see who's here. I know you should be good. Uh, let's see. Sorting crabs is a seven. Okay, not great. Seven. Four. Okay, so we definitely don't want, want Rudy doing anything. Five. Seven. Okay, maybe we do want her. Nine. Okay, so Michael and Nora, or, or Sadie, sorry, sorry, is going to be doing that. Interesting. And then you, I guess, can do that. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out. So, I, I do have a good feeling about this just because of the fact that we have a ton of crab underneath us. Like, this was the, uh, the last bit, and so we have a ton of crab underneath us. So hopefully it'll actually do something, and uh, we have a good amount of crab. Whoa, hi. Whoa, buddy. Whoa. Neither who there were there. Can't really see nothing. Is there a up button? Oh, a little more. There you go. Can't see nothing still, but you know, hey, you, know, you can move the chair. Oh, I saw Northern Lights a second ago. Okay, where is the buoy? Okay, let's not run over our first crab pot. And we pretty much are. So no big deal. No big deal. Okay. <laughs> can we actually turn, please? Oh, there's only one buoy. Oh, crap. Okay, okay, messed up, messed up. No, when we go crabbing in, in, in real life, my uh, my brother, I, and my dad uh, normally goes out there. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's not the easiest thing in the world. So then it, it was a straight-down shot just like that. And uh, so what I, I did was I made a trailer buoy, and that makes life that much easier. I mean, not, not a whole lot, but th just that much easier. Okay, now we should be able to get it now. There we go. Holy mackerel, look at that pot. Oh, you can even hear a little bit. Look at that. Holy cow. Okay. It's kind of, uh... Interesting. So if I wanted to set back, I would just not have him there, I'm guessing. I'm, I'm guessing. I, I have no idea. Well, let's actually try that. for Just for shits and gigs, let's actually just bait and set pot. Oh, too far. Bait and set pot and see what happens. Just for uh, testing purposes. I'm actually going to, um, now that I know that this has to sit for, how long does it have to sit for? 20 hours or something like that. We're definitely going to go out, set these lines again, uh, to, just to see how much we can actually get. And then what we're going to be doing is we're going to uh, go and get our, our net boat, the Arctic Pioneer. And then hopefully we can set that back up and get some more fish and fill that boat quota as well. Because we have $8 million we have to do. So <laughs> <laughs> so we have quite a bit of money we got to pay back. Okay, so here. Let's actually... I wonder if I set... We, we need somebody on the crane. Because that's the only way to get it up. So, I mean, they're taking their, their sweet time, let me tell you. But hopefully it's going to be more lucrative. They're about one to four pounds each. So hopefully uh, we'll have a lot of money worth in here. Jeez, can anybody play the Jeopardy song? Because uh, I feel like that's what we need right now. 
Come on, dudes. Really? You know, sitting next to this pot's not the easiest thing to do, you know. Da, 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 da. Now, of course, they're not the best either, so that, that probably has something to do with it. But let's not give them any. Oh, 865 pounds. So that's not real great. <laughs> that's not real great at all. But, I mean, that is one pot, so you... I mean, if you set all 90 pots, it would take you 10 years to get it done. But at least you would make some money. So what's 300,000 times, like, what, 5? That'd be 1.5 million? So, I mean, the money is definitely here. Well, we'll just have to see what we can do with it. So that's definitely how you do it. You just have to figure out how to get them to do it first. Interesting. Not like we're in a rush. But I feel like this is going to be a little bit of a long one. So I think what I'm going to do, just for, for simplicity's sake, I think of what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fast time it, like time lapse it, because uh, this might actually, not no jokes, might be a while. <laughs> so, uh, as soon as, you know, I'll just time lapse it, and uh, as soon as we are done, uh, I will be back with you, and hopefully we can get a lot of money. Working on this pot, and uh, pretty quickly 
here. They're going to get that pot wherever it did go. There it is. And then hopefully we can get something good in the last two. Because it was has not been doing good at all, honestly. Oh, that's not guilty. Look at there. But anyway, so they're going to get that last pot, hopefully. And then uh, we'll definitely see. Wow, I like how much room we have in here. <laughs> There's a ton of room to, you know, maneuver and do all the space. And somehow, we ha so we have two beds, but we have six people on board. Or, well, seven, including me. Gee whiz, look at that. Oh, well, that's a big one. I mean, look at these tiny fellers. Ain't even big enough to, you know, do anything with. But anyway. So we didn't do too great. Not in the slightest. Uh, let's actually get back in board here. Look at all this fish, though. So what I'm going to do is, honestly, I'm going to get... Uh, we're going to see how much money we can get from uh, the crab here. Because we have basically 9,000 pounds. Uh, plus whatever's on the table now. So we're definitely going to see how much uh, money we get from that. And then actually see if it's going to be worth it. Um, I mean, because I did save it before I, I got this boat and everything else. So we'll definitely see how much we'll get from it. And uh, if not, we will definitely get the other boat and, uh, you know, catch all this. I mean, there's a ton of crab down here. But uh, it very well could be just uh, a lot of small ones. Uh, because that's kind of what it seems like. I mean, because we were on the crab. But, I mean, it just doesn't seem like... Uh, does doesn't seem like we've been doing good. So 17 or 713, 716 in Lundenburg, 714, 709, 715, and 715 either in Dennis Point or Digby. What, what, what one's closer? <laughs> Dennis Point and Digby. It's pretty much Dennis Point's the closest one. So we'll just, you know, basically set up the. Oh, no, 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 no. Get rid of that one. We'll set that up and then we'll just go as fast as we can and see what we can do. But there's a ton of fish here. And uh, just because, you know, we have $731,000 in the bank, we'll uh, see what we can do. And I think that was the beep to be done. It was. They're all standing here doing nothing. So, so what we'll do is... Uh, well, that one wasn't too bad. Let's actually see how much the logbook has here. 412, 6... Oh, no fish were caught. Man, well, no wonder why it didn't work. Oh, you're supposed to click on all these. Oh, great. I didn't know that. I mean, so, I mean, th there was a lot of uh, low numbers. And, uh, you know, it just wasn't... Can I do this? Oh, sweet. Just clear these. I didn't know you were supposed to do this. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> so we'll, we'll go through this one alone, or, uh, together, and then, uh, I'll do that the rest. Oh yeah, a lot of no fish caught, and, uh, yeah, well, yeah. But anyway, so let's go to, oh, well, here, let, let's put these guys to sleep. So there's a lot of fish, or crab over here, too, but let's just put the, all these guys to sleep, or resting mode, or whatever you want to call it, and then hopefully we don't get penalized. Uh, let's go over here to Dennis Point. See how much, how many, how much money we're gonna get. Probably not a ton. Probably a few thousand. Probably about forty-five thousand, if I had to guess. But we'll definitely see. I mean, hopefully we can do a little bit better. But you know, beggars can't be choosers, and uh, we definitely need some money. I mean, maybe we just. I mean, and it took an insane amount of time. I mean, I don't know how much it actually took, but it took a really, really long time. Uh, 58,000. So that's not undersized crab, $200. Female snow crab, $100. So we got fined $300. But that's, that's not, I mean, terrible. So we got 3,300 crab, uh, 93,000 pounds, $7.15. And we got, you know, $58,000. So it's not terrible. I mean, that, that, I mean, that was 15 pots and $58,000. I mean, so we're, we're definitely, we made enough for one loan. So, I mean, we'll definitely have to watch out for that. But anyway, 
I will go out and set a bunch of pots and uh, see what we can do. And I'll definitely see you in the next one. Thank you for watching, commenting, liking, subscribing. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.